Ooh. Man, these past three days are definitely, they're definitely something. Oh my. My face is still a bit swollen, even though this side is definitely going down compared to my uh, left side. I'm doing okay, it's just that, well, I'm still sore from the operation, I guess you could say. And of course, wearing the Santa hat because it is obviously December and I like wearing this in December. Hopefully I can still do my intro properly. <laughs> Hello Maesters, it's just Andy here and today, welcome back to another video. <laughs> um, probably you can tell by the title of the video and the thumbnail Yes, your boy um, actually got his wisdom teeth taken out. <laughs> I did mention this on a community post. Does anyone even check out their like YouTuber community tab post at all? No? But in all seriousness, my boys, I did post a community tab about this that, um, well, I got my wisdom teeth removed and, uh, legit, I posted that like three days ago when I'm recording this and Legit, three days ago was the surgery, so... If you're wondering, this is day three, obviously. And, well, to be honest, the pain is actually slowly but surely, like, making its way down the pain, or essentially sore swelling scale, I guess, I don't know. I'm not sure if you even read it on my community post, but I actually got three of my wisdom teeth removed. If you're wondering about the fourth wisdom teeth that I was supposed to have... It actually never came in, and it will never ever come in at all, like in my entire, in the rest of my life, I should say. But besides the point, I did get three uh, wisdom teeth removed um, three days ago. I got two of them, obviously, from the bottom because they were very impacted, or essentially they came in at an angle. And finally, I got one of the top uh, wisdom teeth removed specifically, and of course the left side because this this side is uh, still a bit swollen and a bit you know sore essentially i had my appointment on a tuesday of this week which was the 12th of december 2023 we arrived my appointment was at eight o'clock sharp and well we got there in time and they brought me back into the uh I guess removal surgery room of where they actually took out my wisdom teeth and from the moment when they inserted me with the uh, little IV you know needle that you know they put in my hand um like within like three to five I think it was three minutes um I legit cannot remember you know how I went to sleep or essentially like falling asleep I should say that's actually a good wording for it <laughs> but anyway um <laughs> I was still asleep when they actually brought me out in a wheelchair, surprisingly. <laughs> we drove home, and yes, if you're wondering, um, I did feel very, 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 very silly, and definitely was coming in and coming out of, you know, consciousness, if that makes sense. I think my brother said it best um, when he was on anesthesia, um, which I don't want to go into, it's just a personal reason it feels like you're very drunk or you're very high and if that's the case then oh my god that is pretty scary to be in especially drunk like holy crap if that's what a drunk person is and feels like oh my god i really do not ever ever want to relive that or even you know become of that in my entire life but yeah i'm still healing from the uh you know at home process of you know recovering um, I've been eating, obviously, the, you know, appropriate of uh, foods, specifically soft foods, you know, like ice cream, uh, pudding, jello, scrambled eggs. Tomorrow is going to be the fourth day of my uh, recovery of the wisdom teeth removal. And, yeah, um, I'm just looking forward to uh, this, you know, full recovery, and hopefully I don't get uh, dry sockets. <laughs> But anyway, you guys, I just wanted to come on here and just make a quick little video. I should have probably mentioned, like, this was just going to be a update video on where I am and what, you know, what's been happening with the channel and the videos lately. Um, make sure to check on my community tab once in a while because, you know, obviously I'll post, like, an update, you know, like, for the wisdom teeth removal, like, three days ago. Or, you know, just random stuff, random crap that I'll, you know, just post on there. 
Um, but yeah, mainly for updates. I really don't usually do updates on there. I don't know why. It's just my w weird thing. But before I go, there are some little updates that I want to mention. Yes, y'all, I've heard the news about Poppy Playtime Chapter 3 being uh, delayed an additional weeks into 2024. Um, you know, it's obviously unfortunate. Um, I mean, I'm pretty sure every game developer does not like doing that. But, you know, hey, they said that this is going to be the biggest and scariest chapter, you know, throughout Poppy Playtime chapter. Or, essentially, the, the through the Poppy Playtime uh, universe. Sorry, it's I'm stuttering and it doesn't help that I, you know, my face is all swollen. <laughs> Another thing is that if I can, I'm definitely going to try and record the, um, uh, that one horror game that I totally missed out on back in, what is it, I think it was released in July, and yes, I am talking about, uh, My Friendly Neighborhood. I've been dying, dying, dying to play it or see gameplay of it, but I've told myself you are not essentially touching or seeing this game until you either record it. Or you don't record it and you just, you know, watch gameplays of it. So, yeah, you have to make a decision, Andy. <laughs> so, yeah, My Friendly Neighborhood gameplay is definitely going to be coming out soon, hopefully. We'll see how my, uh, you know, swollenness of my wisdom teeth are. Hopefully my face is back to normal and my voice doesn't seem, you know, funky to you. But, anyway, talk to you guys then. Bye-bye.